Did you watch Eddie Guerrero's last match live? If so, you would have witnessed the most brutal chair shot in WWE history, where Ken Kennedy would swing that chair with such force that it would knock Eddie Guerrero out cold. Live on SmackDown. Eddie's last match would end in disqualification. In typical lie, cheat, and steal fashion, Eddie Guerrero would trick the referee into thinking that Ken Kennedy struck him in the head with a steel chair. Eddie perfectly sold a chair shot that never happened and was declared the victor. However, Ken Kennedy would get revenge by really striking Eddie with the steel chair. When I tell you this chair shot was brutal, I'd never seen someone get hit in the head so hard with a steel chair. It's like Kennedy was swinging a baseball bat trying to hit a home run. Kennedy whacked Eddie so hard with that steel chair, Eddie barely had time to get his hands up to protect himself, taking the full force of that chair shot right on the top of his head. Now, if you go back to watch this match on WWE's YouTube channel, they freeze the frame because they knew that chair shot was extremely brutal. Perhaps they were trying to do a cover-up, as only a few days later, Eddie Guerrero would be found in his hotel room on a live. Now I'm not saying that chair shot had any correlation, however I'm sure it didn't help. After this heinous chair shot, Eddie was also featured backstage with Batista in a promo where Eddie seemed to be inebriated. You be the judge. Do you think that chair shot put the nail in the coffin for Eddie?